get it going. Let's get it. Gotta send a quick thing to my peeps in the league that the game is live. Got it together, we are live, baby. So excited. I've already played one League One game, but um, <clears throat> I didn't stream it. It was on one of our, it was a user user game. We were at a week zero game. Um, but this is my first official stream back in League One. Excited to be back. I guess I, guess I can say like I can make an official announcement. Um, since I didn't stream the first game, we didn't get to say it. Uh, but, uh, yeah, it's exciting to be back in the League One. Miss my guys, miss this league. Oh, that's exactly where I wanted to be. I don't know what I'm doing here. Um, so, yeah, it, it, it was exciting. But uh, we played a user-user game week one, or week zero, I'm sorry, because, you know, the new college football game does have a week zero in it. And we were able to secure the, the win, 31-7. to seven. It was a great game for, for us defensively. Um, we only gave up 289 yards. You see the 104 on the ground. That is not correct. He did not go 0 for 31, so we got an issue there. But gave him 185 passing yards. The big thing for us, four turnovers. We got four interceptions that game. The defense was locked in, ready to go, um, and pretty much won us that game, getting those 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 four interceptions. Win the turnover battle most of the time. You're Nine times out of ten, you're probably going to still win the game. Um, but, yeah, it, it was a great game defensively. I mean, that's... Any of you that have been around me, follow the channel at all, know that uh, that's not my specialty. But uh, we'll see how it goes now that we're about to head into our first CPU game. This is what our schedule looks like um, for this year going into the you know our League One's 30th season, but the first official season in the new college football game. Um, playing the Iowa Hawkeyes. Hopefully we can knock them out uh, this week. And then we're gonna, so we're on the road in Iowa. Then we're gonna play SMU at home. Then we have another user-user game against West Virginia. Uh, our good friend Brack, or as the gamer tag says, Brack. I don't ever use everybody's full names when it comes to this, just just for their own pur purposes. But good old friend Brack. Then we got uh, another rivalry game against Missouri there. Gonna go on the road against Oklahoma. Oh, just so you know, our conferences are different. I am in part of the Big 12, not the. Um, it's actually actually part of Big 12. I'm sorry. Other teams are part of it. Like obviously, Oklahoma's still in here, so that's different. And then our third user game will be against UCLA. Our good friend Six Gun Ninja. That'll round out our user. We we try to play three user games every season. Obviously, there could be more. Hence, if there is a user in the conference, or if we have um, any users in the conference, or if there is just so happens to be user or uh, you, you, uh, user concert, if user in a bowl or a conference championship, wow, my mind is not working right now. User in a conference championship game could give you another user game, and obviously bowl games um, could possibly too, to do that as well. But yeah, excited for this um, to be able to do this in League One. Hopefully, and have our first league one with with playoffs. That's that's really cool. Um, we do have divisions in ours. So you see, in the Big 12 in this league, we have Kansas, Kansas State, Missouri, Nebraska, Oklahoma, Oklahoma State in the north and in the south is Arkansas, Baylor, Houston, SMU, Texas, Texas A&M, Texas Tech. 
But uh, ultimately, a decision led me to come here. Um, I, the high school that I coach at, the quarterback, one of our previous quarterbacks, Rocco Beck here, went to the high school I coach at. So, of course, when I took to Iowa State, or what led me to decide to go to Ohio, Iowa State when I rejoined League One was was big time, was was this man here, Rocco Beck. Um, so I hope I can do him proud with all these games, have him ball out. Oh. What else? Is there anything else we can do that's kind of cool? Yeah, let's go all white for this one. Let's go, baby. First stream back in League One. Not as great with all the bells and whistles. I don't have my capture card, all that good stuff anymore. I'm just going straight from the from the console. So. But hey, let's go, Charlie. We're still here. We back. You know. That will come as a result of what we're about to see in this one. As we'll see a squad from the Big 12, the Iowa State Cyclones, taking on a team from the Big 10, the uh, Iowa Hawkeyes. For EA Sports College Football, I'm Reese Davis, joined here in the booth by David Pollock and Jesse Palmer. And guys, let's get this thing started. Pretty and evenly matched on the board. The and we'll get started. Let's get it. And they thought about a return, then thought better of it. They'll bring it out to the 25. So the Iowa Hawkeyes offense oh, that's will dope. get the first crack at it here. I haven't well, done an Iowa game like this yet, so I haven't seen that the kind of stuff. Stage, the Cyhawk Trophy always carries paramount importance. And it means so much to the fans. Been to these games a lot of times. The energy is through the roof, and they both want to destroy each other. And what's interesting about this rivalry game is it sets the tone for both programs. They there we go, defense. Early in the year, and like for the that winner, start. it can really catapult you. And the loser's got to pick up the pieces. They're trying to run the ball on first down, another guys, blitz, but just nothing blitz. doing up front. Their offensive line got blown up on that play. There was nowhere for that guy to go. From the gun, they'll try to impose their will. Sit him down, sit him down. Let's go, baby. Giant bodies will call it a one-yard gain to the 24. Last time these two men, Iowa did no, no, Iowa no. things and won a close one. Man, they, they do that so often in this series. They just find a way, even if they're trailing, to win the ball game. And Iowa State's got to figure that puzzle out. Iowa doing Iowa things. Defensively, they made the plays they needed to make in that game. And they're going to have to do that again in this one. He's in a Covered sack, baby. Love that. Let's go. Catastrophic loss on that play. And that is how you silence this raucous crowd. Defensively on the road. First drive of the game, setting the tone, getting a huge sack on third down. The Hawkeyes line up to punt it away. Three and out, and just like that, they'll have to give it up. Running it back, it's Jackson. Oh, this guy is a great. daring punt return man. He's not going to show the hit. fair catch. A solid the boosters. Return. Gets a little bit of ground for the offense. So Iowa State's offense will go to work for the first time today. You know, yards figure to be hard to come by through the air, but some quarterbacks, Jesse, just love to go at the start. Hey, but we already know yeah, Iowa's known for that defense. They ain't known for the offense. He's not afraid to go at anybody, but he better be careful because this cornerback is one of the best in the nation. Come on, son. The best, no doubt. And I think they will trust him on defense to make plays. So you got to make a decision. Is my guy good enough to beat him on the outside? I am fascinated by this matchup. This crowd bringing the energy and noise early. Really nice stop there from this senior leader. It's hard to find a place these days that the Big Ten doesn't touch geographically, but there's a lot of crossover with the Big Ten and Big 12 and plenty of bragging rights on the line when their schools meet. Oh, think about Nebraska, once upon a time being in the Big 12, now in the Big Ten, too. They, these conferences also recruit 
in similar areas, too. So this, this game is interesting, David, because a lot of these players, they're familiar from, uh, with each other from high school. Yeah, and I tell you, from, from experience, you hate that. Like, you get to know each other, you go to the other school, like, you're now my enemy. You're not my friend anymore. So a chance to prove it, a chance for the Big 12 who's been kind of uh, pillaged and pulled apart at times. Some just too much of a rush and down and goes the we do nothing behind the midfield stripe at the 49. The Cyclones will send out the punt unit. First punt of the day and he'd love to lock them up close to their goal line. Ah, I could have put more on no that. No return coming. He'll call for the fair catch. Iowa has it back on offense hoping to ride the wave to the end zone. Last time, David, it was one, two, three, kick. The last drive, that three and out. Sometimes that puts your defense. And that defense, defense, let's go. And down he goes at the nine. The number one job is to protect your quarterback, and they weren't able to do it long enough that time. This offensive line, Reese, they've got to do a better job communicating pre-snap and try and figure out which people on defense are going to be rushing the passer. Right now, this offense just looks blitz, confused man. up front. And they're trying to dig out of the hole on second and long from the nine. Back to throw, it's McNamara. Oh my gosh. That pass is incomplete, and they might they got me on that one. It wasn't knocked free for a fumble. It'll be definitely got down. me on that. Both of these teams right on the fringe of the top 25. This is the type of game that can help you earn some respect. Absolutely. Man, I mean, both these teams sitting right outside the top 25 have a great opportunity to get a good quality win and start to build momentum early in this season and see what kind of squad you're going to have, Palmer. Both of these teams just want respect. That, They've worked how is so that not all a all season, all season up to this point to try to get that number beside their name? And this is the game if you Win it, you're gonna get it. How is that not a freaking intentional grounding? You threw it straight Doesn't out of bounds. When you're forward to the punt. Okay, let's do something on offense now. He'll bring it back. It's Jackson. Oh, get outside, get outside, get outside, get outside, get outside. Ah! Finding some running room on that return and was able to set up the offense with good field position. A great spot to start this drive for the offense. The give to the tailback. Blast his way Dang ahead, man. but not much room. A pickup of one to the 24. Didn't get much on first down and second and We're nine. We're in field goal range, but geez, man, we got to do something. He'll run it again. And they try the middle of this defense, and that is not happening. And just a great job on the defense being stout. Right? That's your job. Be stout up front, stuff in the run play, make them get in more passing situations, but do not let them run the football. That's one on one. Stop the run first. On third and long, he's going to have to throw for it. And that's incomplete. A defender all over him. Knocked the ball to the ground. Fourth down coming up. I mean, what? Tell you what, I don't know if yeah. the offense was expecting yeah. man coverage that time. Third and long in field goal range, you're expecting it to be zone. Instead, they lock what? them up man to man, everybody on an island, and everybody sucks. won. They get the incompletion now setting up for And the kicker delivers the three to salvage that drive. I'm sorry. And the first points of the day come on that field goal. Why would you take my phone, come back in here, and then. Man, who would have thought that uh, offense would be my struggle? <laughs> That's never been my struggle. And it'll normally. come out to the 25. No attempt at a return. Iowa has the ball back on offense. The last time we saw this offense, we had to look quick. It was a three and out, Jesse. We just had no rhythm in that last drive. So someone's going to have to step up and make a play, David, and get this thing going. Yeah, Almost thought I was play action. Juice. Find your guy. Find those plays that you know you can run inside out, forward, backwards. Get some first downs. Get some positive momentum. And that's a really nice play. It's impressive. When it's first down and the defense thinks you might be running the football, you still can line up and get some movement at the point of attack and find a little crease for your running back. He'll grab the throw to the sideline and step out of bounds after pitching up a few. This rivalry is so important to the people of this state, and it dates back to 1894, guys. 
Yeah, it goes back a long way. And when you watch the product on the field every year, it's usually low scoring. But Selling it's out, they do like to run. Tough people on the field. Yeah, and you know, people in Iowa, they just love football. And this is a rivalry game that really hits home for so many. Regardless uh, of which side of the fence you're on, in this game, Iowa or Iowa State, it means so much. You know, as a receiver, it's so critical and important to know where the sticks are. He was able to modify his route so he knew as soon as he caught it, he was just going to have enough to keep this drive alive. Oh, no, sir. Way to stay home. Way to stay home. For an offense, That's what I'm to talking make a wide receiver maybe. reverse work, you've got to have a lot of guys doing a good sell job. Running backs have to behave as if they're actually going to keep the football, and everybody else on offense has to be yelling out, run! To try to make the defense over pursue, but no Oscars being handed out on Leaves it with the Oh dang, they got me on that. Oh, he gave him the limp leg. And they get him down. That was it a got me on that motion. I thought it was gonna come that way. Hole, but on second in California, they dial up the running play, now setting up third and short. Just shy of midfield at the 47. The defense needs a third down stop. They'll try to power their way ahead. Oh my God! Gets away from one. Finds him. Just keeps moving. Ripping Dang through it. the Come defense on. and getting it all the way down to the 24-yard line. The Hawkeyes will hustle to the line. Third down and two. You know it's time to get physical, and this unit paves the way. Jesse gets the big first down. And this back's got such a burst oh too. Oh my gosh! Hey, good job because I whiffed. <laughs> and they knock him down at the 31. What a great job by this defense setting the tone early. In the first half, they've been hitting the quarterback early and often. Make him feel uncomfortable. Make him feel that pressure. Keep getting him on the ground. That's why they've built a lead. Motion by the back forces the defense to adjust. To the air. It's McNamara. Oh, he makes the catch. They make this great tackle, great before. open for the tackle. Takes a chunk out of what they need to move the sticks. Nice patience by the quarterback here, working against zone coverage. He was allowing his receiver an opportunity to find that open space in the defense before pulling the trigger. They've got a ways to go on third down from the 24 as this defense tries to force him into a field goal try. Didn't have much of a choice, just had to Thank throw goodness. that one I away. Wanted to switch. Fourth down. Nice job by the defense. They're mixing up their look. They're third and long in field goal range. They go zone coverage. So everybody on the back end has the eye on the quarterback, and they're able to break on the ball, force the incompletion. And it's right. Cover shows a good ball game here. And after the three spot, guys, we're all tied up. And we're all square as he's set to kick it away. On the move from inside his spot. Really disciplined job by the coverage unit to get down there and make the stop. Bum, the bum, Iowa bum, State bum, sent bum, the offense bum, back bum, out. Bum. David, they couldn't pay off that last All right, we need to get something down. going. Now they moved the ball down the field and executed like they wanted to until they stalled out and had to settle for a field goal. I think if you want to take the next step two here and score a touchdown, you got to start finding more creative ways to get your best players the ball. Let's see if they there can. There we go. Here. They stay aggressive and push their way. There we go. The That's what we mean. And it's first down. And there was no question in that scenario. That's where the quarterback was going. He knew he had his receiver in a matchup that he liked, running a route where he would find himself open. Nice job between those two. And he was drilled. Good just thing I got hit because that probably would have been picked. Line that would have been a bad pass and got intercepted. We're already in the first quarter, but already you get the feeling this could be a long day for this QB. He's already been sacked. He gets hit right there on the incomplete throw. I got to find a way to get the run game going. A better job up front of protecting this guy, or it's going to be difficult to put up points. Here comes this home crowd as the defense tries to get off the field on third down. Coming at nowhere to go, and the ball is loose. No way. And the defense jumps on it, and they get that turnover. You know, as quarterbacks, you've got to be good in the pocket. Even when things are collapsing, and you've got guys swiping at it, you've got to have two hands on the football. Didn't do a really good job with ball security there, and that led to the fumble. Feeling some heat. And they get the sack right out of the gate. 
I think if you're the quarterback moving forward, you need to start thinking about hot routes to your tight ends and to your running backs because of this outside linebacker. He's a guy that has shown the knack to get after the QB. When he comes blitzing, you need to have an outlet throw in your back pocket. They'll run play action. Fires to the middle. Got his man downfield. That's me. He's brought down, Stop, but he's it. got him inside the 10. First and goal from the eight. This offensive scoring position with a fresh set of downs. With the run on first and goal. And how about that interior defense stuffing the run for nothing? Great team defense on that one play. Everybody doing their job. People winning their one on one. D linemen staying in their gaps. Linebackers and DBs filling. You just can't do it better. And that's going to be incomplete. A lot of contact on the play, but no flags. Ah. It'll be third down. Let's go, baby. Lock them up. They line up with some serious work to do if they want to convert this one. They'll try to pass it in on third and goal. Got it in the middle. It's Lachey. No! And he'll hold it and take it to the end zone. Touchdown, Iowa. Well, just as you would expect, that didn't take very long. It didn't, Reese. And you've got to make great field position count. When you've got opportunities, you got to pay it off. And the offense took advantage, scoring a touchdown. Didn't have far to go, but they got the points they needed. He'll bring it out from inside his own 10. He was looking for some running room, but not much to be found as he stopped at the 18. Iowa State has right. the ball back. The Cyclones ready to go on offense. Out of the gun to give to the back. They stop him after There's a six-yard run something. out to the 24. I know it's sexy to throw the football, but if you can pound it away and get these kind of gains, they will just add up, wear the defense down, get first downs, and ultimately get some points. Caught in the backfield, it's Jackson. And they knock him down, but he got yes. past the line. We need him. I just love quarterbacks need that aren't greedy and that aren't always trying to throw the home run ball, right? Second down, you're in your own end of the field. The guy you want to throw to is not open. Just find the back. He'll go do something positive with it. This guy is a weapon, and you got to find him in the passing game. Drag down after a pickup of five like that. after the 35. As they get set to snap it, just about to reach the end of the quarter. I'm going to let the quarter run out. I don't really like this. I think I like this look, so I'm going to take this second quarter. We've reached the end of one, and as is tradition here in Iowa City, we take a moment to say hi to the children of the University of Iowa, Stead Family Children's Hospital. Yeah. Hello, kids. That's awesome. Jeez, look at this. You want to talk about a defensive battle right now? We can see those average yards per no play. No matter how many times you see it, a moving moment here at Iowa between the first and second quarter when the entire crowd acknowledges the children across the way. Hope they enjoy the game as we continue in the second quarter. They're working that left side. And he'll have enough for the first down at the 42. Ever since they invented the forward pass, the tight ends have been running the drag and getting the first down. I think it's because the tight ends, is so much versatility. You know, they can block and stay in the formation, or they can release and come out. But either way, if the quarterback's patient, most of the time, that drag route's going to come in. Solid pickup of four on first down. It's second and six. Looking downfield, it's Beck. And the quarterback is snowed under. Well, I think one of the biggest reasons why this team is finding themselves in a hole here in the first half is this has been a sack party. They can't keep the defense off of their quarterback. They haven't been able to get the ball deep down the field, throwing it with the consistency they want because they can't keep their quarterback standing. Let's go, baby. Nifty little scamper on this one. Enough for the first down. And he's. Oh, it's been all safely. defense. And the Cyclones come to the Crazy. line with a fresh set of downs. Give to the back. Yo, come on, come on. There we they go. That was a good stop, one. But this running game moves the chains as they get the first down. Well, it just seems like everything is working for the offense on this drive. Another nice game, this time on the ground. Got it. 
Finally, this offense starting to show a little juice. They've got a first and ten. He wants to throw. Finds his man down the middle. How much lingerie is this guy going to leave on the deck as he gets it down to the 25? Here comes Here the go. offense. Here we go. Now down. we're getting this moving. He's looking to throw. Grabbed over the middle. It's Higgins. Dragged down to the turf, but not before getting the first down. Well, this offense knew coming into this game, they wanted to try to attack the middle of the field in the passing game, and they're able to execute the in route there. They've moved it to the 19, first and 10. From the red zone, looking for a space. And the defense, they've got him at the 27. Oh, my gosh. All right, offense has got to be better. You've done a nice job getting the football to this point in the red zone, but now you can't go backwards. You've got to be able to get rid of the football if it's not there, and that was a terrible play giving up the sack. They've already racked up big sack numbers. It's starting to snowball, and they are ready to go again. Dropping back, it's back. Got his man quickly. They bring him down, but a solid pick up, pick up with him in good. position to pick up a first down. And I think this receiver's forte is his route running. He's a guy that can line up all over the field, but it's not just catching post routes and goes. This guy can run shallows. He can run slants. He can run the option routes and find soft spots in the defense. This guy really has all the routes in his toolbox. Dang it. On third down, he'll try to pick it up through the air. And the rush will get to him at the 25. Now it looks as if they'll settle for the field goal try. And for the second time, they'll go for the field goal. The first one was good, and they'll try from third. Uh, Absolutely. Ooh. Perfect. I'm just scared. I don't know. I wasn't sure. Oh, we gotta get get the offense going, man. But Iowa, like we so like I said earlier, like we know this team is, team is ready to boot it away. known for defense. He'll start the return inside his spot. Really disciplined job by the coverage unit to get down there and make the stop at the 19. Iowa has it back on offense, hoping to ride the wave to the end zone. Jesse looking to take it down the field for back-to-back -back touchdowns. I think it's really important for them moving forward, too, to have a lot of... Dang it, right? it's the second time I've bit to that. Defense guessing, Paul. Yeah, and you got me searching for answers after that last drive. You stack another drive on top of this, their defense's heads are going to be spinning all over the place. The handoff to Johnson. Oh! Slam to the ground, but not before he gets the first down. I almost spilled that All right, nice. nothing flashy there. He just did what it took to get the first down. It'll be first and ten from the 30. Right back to the well. Dragged down after a pickup of five out to the 35. I know the passing game sells. Off, right? The passing game is exciting, but it's not exciting to get five or six yards of pop on the ground, but it will be very successful. Halfway there on first down, it's second and five. Give to the running back. Fighting off the defender. Gets Dang it to it, the 42-yard line, and that's a first down. Well, with the weapons this offense has, you knew it was just a matter of time in the run game before someone was going to break a long one. They've just been running into a wall that just couldn't seem to find their creases and get enough movement up front, but they finally got it there, picking up the first. Let's see what happens next. Turn down. That's there we go, D. There we go, D. From a senior, don't give them any extra yards. Great tackle there. You know, runs like this oftentimes are like a boxer in a boxing match. Obviously, it's not a knockout punch, but these are body blows. As the game goes on, these small gains are going to turn into longer runs. Pre-snap motion quarterback trying to get a read. Softened him up with a run and now the throw. 
He's got oh, he held on to that? They stop him almost immediately. Short game there and still a little ground to cover to pick up the first. They were able to get the ball to the running back in space, but that space just evaporated. And a great job by the defense, man. It's tough to get those guys on the ground. They're so used to being having the football as running backs and making plays and being dynamic. So usually one guy not going to get into the ground. Good defense, baby. Football, trying to get that elusive guy on the ground. And the guys send out the punt unit. A high kick trying to pin them deep. Not going to risk a return here. Right, He'll make on. the fair catch. Iowa State sending the offense back out. Guys, that last trip a little disappointing having to take the three. And I think, Jesse, you see so many offenses talk about getting yards and the tempo and all the stuff they do. It was a nice job moving the football, but they got to get in the end zone this time. Yeah, and I think to do that, they just got to be... And here's a fumble. No. No. Defense no. the ball. Going to be a turnover. And when you're on... No. The officials to have another look at the monitor using a timeout here. Thinks the call is going to end up going I don't his want to way. Lose yards, but that's not a fumble. Might have to give that coach a flag and a whistle. He was right on in his view of the play, and the officials agree and overturn the call. Didn't make it any easier on themselves on first down. Now second along from the 21. They knock him down after a gain of three to the 23. To the wide out. Oh my gosh, let's go. Let's field. go. Hit the gas, kid. Wide open ahead. That's what Slippery we needed, baby. Let's go. One of the reasons this offense there is, so is exciting to watch. They've Beautiful. got guys that are dangerous Beautiful. after the catch. And if this quarterback gets through his progression, David, it's Beautiful. on stride, these guys will take it to the house. Man, it's your job to do the rest, right? You hit me in stride where I don't have to stop running. I don't have to break down. It makes it Maybe, so oh, yeah. easy. The connection between quarterback, wide receiver. You can tell great, this great, is a good one. And that's why they got six. Great decision to ch challenge. And then we take advantage of it. What? Huh? And about to kick it off after punching it in for the touchdown. We have Ron Weasley. Okay. On stream. If you get in front of the camera, look. Yeah. On the run from inside yeah. his own five. Really disciplined job by the company. Get the same here. here. Of course I do. Hi. Iowa has the ball back on offense. They just didn't quite find the rhythm oh, on that last drive, Jesse. They had to punt it. I think they got to be more physical, David. I think up front they got to do a better job of getting blocks and establishing this huh? running game. And how easy does football become if you're the more physical team? If you can threaten the run and then then run play action, it opens up the whole. It's the lane. That's a preview. They wrestle him to the ground, but he's got plenty for a first down. I'll tell you what. A few more runs like that, and defensively, you start thinking. More guys in the box, more big guys. I now here comes the pass. guy because he's unbelievable. Just a great job breaking off the big run, and the OC is going to give him the ball some more. Comes out throwing on first down. Finds his tight end. Oh, come on now. And oh, he was off to the races after the catch, and they finally drag him down. Looking to go up top on first down. Fires to the big fella. And he'll step out of bounds. Same route. I let the same route play. get me. Man, these plays are really, really simple. Really easy to run. I like it. Just drop back as a quarterback. See the big fella. Wait for him to get open. Hit him. Get a nice positive game. Why aren't you in the flats? He's out of bounds, but not before picking up enough for the first down. The Hawkeyes come to the line with a new set of downs to throw. It's McNamara. 
He's got his man. Hey, listen, on offense, just take what the defense gives you. The quarterback oh. looks out wide. He sees the DB way off of the receiver. Throw him the easy hitch pass. You'll take that completion. What? Yes, I did. Second down coming up. I just, He's I just looking did. to throw. Gets it out quickly. He's really what? close to that first down marker, but they stop him just a bit short. What's important in this game is offense that. gets the running back involved out in the perimeter in space where he can do some damage. That time they got it to him throwing the football. He picked up a couple of yards, but it gives the defense something to think about. They're looking at a third down and short from the 33. They want to just keep throwing it. And the heat gets ah. knock him down back at the I think he wanted to go to the tight end, so I took that away. Here by the defense. It's the first one they've Time used this hand. The name of the game is protecting no, your quarterback. No. He can't have success. I'm pretty sure that they want to go to the tight end there, took that away, and forced his punt, maybe. maybe. Football off, but whatever we're doing, let's go the opposite direction. You'll call for All right. a fair catch here. First down here for the offense. He wants to start this drive with a pass. And he was hit. That was there. Was the oh my gosh, that was there. And that defender was just smothering the quarterback on that screen attempt. You know, the QB's taught to hold on to it to the last possible second. He had no shot trying to negotiate that defender. Fires to the big Come on. fella. At the 45. Ah, oh, should have got out of bounds. Big, big gain on that one as he steps out of bounds with a first down. His offense lines Great play, up though. Great play. Awfully good after that big play. Scanning the field. It's back. Immediately fires to the middle. Stopped after making the catch. The Cyclones in the hurry up. On second down, wants to throw it. Working that left side now. Brought down at the 38. It's a pickup of 10 and a first down. Here's this offense with a fresh set of downs. They'll throw it on first down. Oh, my gosh. The pass intercepted. He'll go down right there, but what a big play to come up with that turnover. Rain, sleet, snow, sun shining. I don't care. I get interceptions. Give me that rock. Quickly to the tight end. A timeout is called as this offense tries to find a way to get more points on the board before the half. After the short Golly, completion, man, it's now second down. I shouldn't have thrown that pass. He's looking to throw. Caught over the middle. It's Lachey. There's a timeout on the field. Tight game here late in the first half. They'll snap this one from the 42. It's first and 10. The back goes in motion. He'll come out throwing on first down. Gets it out fast. And they wrap him up, but not before. He gets enough on the catch for the first down. The offense quickly calls timeout to stop the clock. Now across the 50 and at the 48-yard line, they'll have it first and 10. Looking to move it through the air. That pressure got to him, and he just had to chuck Crap. it out of bounds. I understand, man. Dwindling away as they try to That's put coming. points on the board right before the half. Scrap. To the air, it's McNamara. Just had to get Trapped rid again. of that one. Good job to avoid the loss. And it's third down, but they're going to go ahead and try the field goal and try to get points before the break. No good. And after the miss, they're still down by a field goal. Listen, he's a guy that makes 60 yarders in practice, so they give him that opportunity with his big leg. He misses it. The opponent didn't set up the return, so they're going to get the football back now. A pretty good field position. There's still a few ticks left on the clock. They've got a chance to steal some points here late in the half. They'll Dang use it. a timeout right before halftime. Maybe time for one or two more plays. Just enough time to get off one final play of the half.
He's going to pass. He hurls one deep down the left side. It's incomplete. Uh, they tried to finish this quarter take a with a shot. and couldn't quite connect. First half in the books. Grab me a drink real quick. Be right back. In our halftime update. Fellas, it's one thing to have a rivalry game. But when you have two longtime foes separated by roughly 100 miles duking it out for the Cyhawk trophy, you know emotions tend to run high. And we have to start this halftime breakdown by addressing the play of this elite wide receiver. This is clearly a young man who, once he's finished playing on Saturdays, he's going to be playing on Sundays. The kid has different gears. He has a knack for finding gaps in the defense. And I can't remember a college player with that kind of catch radius. With that, let's throw it back to the guys to see how the fight between Iowa and Iowa State plays out. Thanks for that breakdown, Kevin. Looks as if we're set to crank it up here in the second half. And he'll just take a knee, and this drive will start at the 25. Iowa State has the ball back. The Cyclones ready to go on offense. Dang it. I missed my they chance to make a return. This third quarter. Think how big the lead might be if they've taken care of the ball. Well, the game might be over, Reese, but if you're on defense right now, you've gotten a couple turnovers early, and you're saying, okay, we're going to... They get an uprush. What am I doing? takes off the sack at the 20. They'll try to keep that sack from wrecking this drive here on second and 15. They'll go to the ground. They make the stop. I'll take that. Before. I'll take that as a good play there. They need to move the sticks. Listen, you, you got to be able to know what play to call and what oh, play to do. Like the line. I gotta take a pause real quick. Well, actually, I don't have to take a pause, but. job getting through the hole, getting on this block, getting a nice positive game, making your situation really good on the next day. Decibel Yo. rising as the crowd gets behind this defense on third down. Dropping back, it's back. Yes. He finds his man. Good tackle there to stop him short of the first down. It'll bring up a big decision. And the Cyclones will bring the punt team onto the field. This will yes. be the second time they've had to kick it away. Makes the catch and now looking for just... No, you can buy it from the store. Daylight. Same thing, like buy it online and then... There offset some of the punt yardage yeah. and really sets up this offense nicely. Three tight ends in the formation on first and ten. He's looking to throw it. That one never had a chance. Yep. Incomplete. Man, this defense yeah, no problem. ruthless all game long. Love you. Individual effort. They've got guys right. up front winning their one-on-one -on -one matchups, and they have been terrorizing this quarter. Uh, I don't know. I don't think anything, really. up a second down for this offense. Out of the shotgun, they go to the ground. Turns it on in midfield. And Are you doing that for Casey's birthday? All right, yeah, we'll, we'll uh, we'll Saturday, what time? The 47 on first and 10. Okay. He wants to throw. Pocket starts to collapse. Oh. And they got him. They'll get him down for the sack. Okay. Sometimes yeah. you I'll talk to Allie about it. Really don't like each other. All right. This guy sure doesn't like anybody on the other side. He's tackling everybody. And that's the kind of defender I want. The guys who don't like people. They love collisions. They love to throw their body around. Jesse, he's been all over the field. And this guy's good yeah, I've never week been. in week out, right? But in this game, he just seems like he's more dialed in. And he's playing at a different oh, intensity okay. level right now than I think anybody else on the field. He wants to throw here on second down. And it's incomplete, but there's a flag in the backfield. Let's see who the call's on. Holding penalties, the oh, ultimate that's dope. drive killer. We'll see if it costs this offense here. 
Let's see what they've got on second down. All right, you too, man. Looking to pass. It's McNamara. And he's all bottled up, and now it's worse. The ball's loose. They recover their own fumble. Oh, Somehow, my gosh. All right. Who knows how they got that thing back. They locked back in now. And those are so Turn the volume back up. Where is the volume? You swarm to the football, and you stick the quarterback, and you make him cough it up just to have the other team recover it again, and you don't We should have got that fumble. Still a good stick, still a good physical play. Keep it in that quarterback. He'll need some juice in that arm on third and long. And he feels Sack again, boy. Fourth and 55. Another sack. Oh. another sack on the day. This offense has to do something different. Maybe bring in more bodies, run max protection, keep more guys in the block, only send a couple guys out to run pass patterns. You got to do something different. But bottom line, you got to protect that QB. I don't even know what they the were doing there. Like, that was not even a good play call. Punt. They've been busy out there to punt for the fifth time today. Another punt on the oh, way. Oh, we got a chance to return. Sure oh. And glutes all activated. Don't want any muscle pulls from overuse. The Great return, baby. We got to. Hey, Brandon Hagel, go. After a punt on their last possession, they are set up in plus territory this time. And honestly, it wouldn't have mattered if they scored a touchdown in their last possession. You've got to be able to turn the page and see this is a brand new opportunity to go get points. Yeah, and your defense has set you up for the position to get points right away. Now, let's get this offense back rolling again. Create some momentum. Just get a few first downs on in scoring position. They get him on the ground with this running game to... imposing its will. Six yard gain down to the 17. I think one of the hardest things to do is stick to the run when it's not working. But it's those runs right there that are the reason why you have to do it, right? You can't get too one-dimensional. Keep slipping those runs in there. Keep getting a little bit of positive yards. Next thing you know, you look up and you might break one of those after you got them a little bit tired. Man, that D tackle is a freak athlete. Did you see him come out of the stance and beat the offensive lineman? Getting to the running back, cat-like quickness. Third down, and this crowd is tearing the lid off this place. Looking downfield, it's got back. the field goal. It's caught. And he's smart play, down, smart route. Before moving the chains. I knew I had. Really I nice knew I had the quarterback understanding that it's zone coverage on third down. You're gonna have to find someone working into a soft spot. Get the ball out of your hands quickly. Make an accurate throw and pick up the first. Well done. The Cyclones are threatening on first and goal. They'll try to get it in with the run. And maybe they want to try somewhere else because there is nothing doing in the middle of this defense. It's hard to run on a defense that comes off the ball like that and runs to the football like that. Good luck. No holes anywhere. Defense rolls up deep in its own end on that last play. Now a second no, we need and to score man. What was that? Running play to the left, looking for the end zone here. And he's ridden Cute. to the ground, but there's also a flag down. Let's check the call. Oh, oh my gosh, holding, come on. We'll repeat the previous down, but this time the offense has 10 more yards it has to cover. And the D deny them on second and goal. Motion trying to get the defense to show its hand. They're bringing heat. Quarterback feeling the pressure and down he goes at the 22. The offense right now is moving in the wrong direction. They weren't able to get a touchdown in that first down play. Now giving up a negative play on second down. You better be very careful about this third down play call. Using the back as a receiver on the screen. Ah, so good play. To just take what the defense gave him, and they were able to stop him short of the first down. Dang it, man. And when you're a defense and you get third and long and you know exactly where those sticks are, you set your feet at them, they throw it underneath. I go oh, my god! tackle. Perfect I thought I was way over. Execution by this defense. And let's check in with Kevin Connors in the studio. Kevin? Guys, let's recap that ranked-on-ranked -ranked matchup that has just gone final. 
Tell you what, this is a fun game. This is absolutely fun game. Winning this one by double digits, although it felt like it could have been more. Somewhere even Bo Jackson is impressed with this It's eight sacks for me in seventh round. This is crazy. just so tough. And we found that out again today, guys. Hey, Will Sam 3, Will Sam 3, ready? Kevin, thanks a lot for that one. Sounds as if they had a good one there. Hand off to the single oh. running back. They Ooh. knock him down after a gain of three to the 23. After the three-yard pickup, they come to the line second and seven. Looking to throw, it's McNamara. He just got rid of that one to save the down. Didn't oh, I got lucky because that was a screen, and we definitely did not read it. A third and long coming up here. From the gun, wants to pass. Holds it in. And they finally get him down, but not before. He's got him set up for business at the 49-yard line. Well, how about the offense setting that play up? We've seen earlier in the game a couple shorter throws, just trying to suck those safeties close to the line of scrimmage, anticipating that they would get an opportunity to take a shot. They called the perfect play at the perfect time right there. Pressure coming. Didn't have much of a had that lock. to get rid of it. Had that guy in the flouts locked up. They'll line up for a second down play. Looking to throw it again. Finds a tight end. Oh my gosh, that is whiffed. 34 yard line. Give him 15 yards on the pickup and a first down. That throw and catch, a really good example of why coaches don't want a quarterback to get stuck on a particular target, isn't it, David? Yep, that's exactly right. Find the guy who's open because you got so many guys that have so much speed that can do so much damage on the field. Find my matchup, get it to uh. him, let him do the rest. And he's knocked down immediately, but not before he moves the chains. The Hawkeyes will snap it on first and ten. Leaves it with the running back. They bring him down, and he's going to lose a yard on that one. Then you hear about run blitz. This coming. is exactly what a run blitz is. When you know the ball is coming up the middle, you want to bring those linebackers, get them closer to the line oh, of scrimmage, or not. and fire right when the ball snaps. Oh! He's downhill, doing a good job creating a loss. That linebacker really Come on, knew he can't give it a It's a really nice job of the offense mixing it up on this drive. You've seen some nice plays throwing it. How about that one running it too? Great push up front. Looking for a man. It's McNamara. Quickly complete. They go up top to get it down to the five-yard line as they try to pay off this drive. It'll be second down, and remember, they can pick up a first without scoring. Jet sweep to the receiver. That time they, they actually did the jet sweep. <laughs> no the one time I don't go into it. Defense shutting down that jet sweep. You see the team speed they have on defense. They are willing and ready and able to go sideline to sideline with anybody in the country. They'd love to crap, pick crap, up crap, this crap. third down and get a fresh set with first and goal. In the gun, looking to throw on third down. Getting some heat. Couldn't find a man and just had to throw it away to avoid a negative play. This man, because I don't hope they don't. I don't want him to hit the kicker. This one ought to be nice and easy. A 22-yard attempt. It is good. Woo! After putting up the field goal, they're set to kick it away. returner will field it and try to get some field position he was looking for some running room but not much to be found as he stopped at the 18. iowa state has the ball back the cyclones ready to go on offense 
Always good to get points on a drive, David, but chip shot field goals can leave you a little empty. And I think it's great to get points, but the great teams get touchdowns in the red area. You gotta yeah, get out gotta there this time tough. and execute a little better on this drive. You're absolutely right, David. Generally, the best red zone offenses are the ones that run the ball the best. So, let's see if they can be a little bit more physical on this group. And the defense doing a great job committing to the run. When you commit to the run like this, obviously, you can give up some plays in the passing game, but you got to stop the run first. Not seeing a lot of chemistry between the QB and his intended target on that one. is called for you want oh, to make oh, oh, sure oh. that you field it cleanly in rainy weather like this iowa has it back on offense hoping to ride the uh, way to the end zone all right come on man to settle for the chip shot field goal last time jesse they'd love for this one to pay off bigger yeah it just comes down to execution too did a nice job out in the field stalled a little bit once they got down to the goal line so they just need to be a little bit more crisp here yeah, and listen, I think the first part was the most important part. you got to put the drive together first to get down there. Now, when we get down there, focus on execution and getting six points. He's going to pass on second down. Get it out on the screen. Come on. Still on his feet at the 45. And they'll move the change with the first down. That might be it for the third quarter. That's the end of the Come period. Come on, boys. Put them fours up. Fours up. In a strong position here with the lead. Let's take a look at our game summary. Look at that. 24 rushing yards. That's so bad. No rushing. Neither team can run the ball right now. Not only is the scoreboard on their side, but so too is time as we open the fourth. They'll start the drive here with first down. All right, come on, defense. Period. Keep it up. Looking to move it through the air. Trying to get to it. And Locked up, baby. Scrap. Strap. Quarterback and receiver failed to hook up. They'll try it again on second down. They'll try the run. Oh, what a move! Just what this offense was looking for. Sets him up at the 26 with the first down. They'll give it to him again. And a nice job by the running back, finding space, getting downhill, making the good run. Great job finishing with his pads. They can really be aggressive after that last play. It's second and three. Back to throw. It's McNamara. Takes the easy one to the back. Great tackle. The defense wouldn't let him lose there, and it was a completion, but they lost yardage. Hey, on offense, you got to know when the play's over. That one there, nowhere to go with it after he caught the football. You, you start trying to juke guys. You start trying to run backwards. This ain't high school anymore. I mean, you used to be able to make that play years ago. You're not doing it here in Big Ten College. Good job, football. D. Not good. good job, defense. And it's not the worst decision in the world. Listen, you want to force this down the field on third and long, get the first down, but you also got to realize a field goal ties Oof. this football game. Smart play by the quarterback. Smashes it between the uprights. And we are all tied up here in the fourth. And Man, we, we have us as a ball. Okay. Set to kick it away. Looking for an alley from inside his own 10. And the returner will be brought down. Iowa State sending the offense back out. Boy, three and out last time, David. They'd like to be more productive this time around. Yeah, in the last drive, nothing really clicked. No rhythm. Got off the field really, really quickly. They need to put... He tosses one high, 
in deep down the left side. And it's Dang it. They were looking for the huge the game on first I mean, I don't, I'm not upset taking those shots because I'm getting the one-on-one -on -one coverage, but man, we got to make a play. And it's second down. He's looking to throw. Unloads to the wideout. Just masterful. There we go. Sideline and getting the two Ooh. down for the catch. Now from the 36 yard line, it's first and 10. The give to the back. Not a whole lot of room there. Three yards, maybe. Second and seven. It, it's just simple. Simple first down run, showing your physicality, setting your offense up in a good spot. Got three on first down. It's second and seven. We just have not been able to get the ball. Hand off from the gun. Shakes off the tackle. He had all kinds of I can't get anywhere. He, got it. he had to fight his way back just to get to the line of scrimmage. Well, they want to come out and try to get the run game established, but up front defensively, they made a play. They gave up nothing on that one. Got to find some breathing room if you're going to establish yourself on the ground, and there wasn't any that time. Yeah, Reese, I wonder now. And the ball comes out. No. Disastrous play. Oh, and he's able to get that guy has back, five sacks, like a D tackle, play. like my interior off of the line is struggling. Thirty seconds. You got seventeen guys running at it, slow motion. Like I gotta get the football offense. Very lucky to get that football back. Fourth down, and the punt team sends it the other way. Switch through the line. They'll put a stop to that return. Ah, oh, man, come on. Yard. They had to kick a field goal the last time they had it. Yeah, and oftentimes early in games, you're just trying to find your rhythm. Some things work, some don't on that first drive, David. Be interesting to see what happens here on the second drive. Yeah, you got a feel for the defense now. You understand what they're trying to do, what their game plan is. Now you get to go into phase two of your game plan. And now on second down for this offense. From the gun, the ground game. Great move there. Lots of green grass. Gotta stop missing tackle. The and the Hawkeyes moving quickly to the line. Yeah, defensively, you better be ready to run east and west when you're playing against this offense in their running game. That time, the offense was able to outflank the defense to the right side for a big play. They'll get him on the ground after a pickup of three to the 28. Small game, I know, but again, the defense knows he's gonna run the football. He's willing to run the football, not just drop back. And now they're getting run game going, but I'm not, man. You I gotta do it. a lot of this. Looking to throw, it's McNamara. Oh, no, the ball popped out. And they are fortunate to get the ball back, but unfortunate to have a long way to go after that loss. Woo. Deep oh my gosh. <laughs> relief. He's able to recover it. You know, that you could have been deck, huge for us. Panic, but great job that. getting back to the fumble, recovering his own fumble. Otherwise, whew, that could have been bad. What they would give to help their kicker out with a few yards on third down. From here, it would be a 55 yard. And the pressure is coming in, and they yes. get him again. And these Defense. situations, third and eternity. I know exactly Holy crap, man. That was huge for us. I know it's a huge pass. defensive series. My best pass defenses, and then I turn my pass rushes loose. Go get that QB. Fair catch called for and made. Iowa State has the ball back. The Cyclones ready to go on offense. That last drive won't go on the highlight reel after ending in a punt. They'd like to be more productive this time, David. And I think this offense has to be a little bit more balanced. Find a little balance between the run, Jesse, and working in that pass. And I think, too, David, it's just going to take a spark. It just takes one play to get this thing picked up and going. That keeps the running game churning. Pick up a five to the 23. I, I like it. Just frustrate the defense. Get that five to six yards. Make them honor the run. Make them know that you're willing to run the football and run it effectively. Halfway there on first down, it's second and five. They'll give it to the back. They get him stopped after a gain of four out to the 28. It's a nice game, but the big theme here is they just haven't been able to get the run game going. Muffins, they've been very one-dimensional. They're just not being physical enough. is coming maybe the biggest play of the game 
They'll try to pick it up on the ground. And with that effort, they pick up a fresh Thank set goodness. of downs. They have it at the 34-yard line. You know, they pride themselves on being physical at the point of attack, dominating at the line of scrimmage. Nice job there picking up the first down. Wants to throw on first down. Just too much mustard what on was that. that? Can't miss the target that badly. Man, as a quarterback, you got to be careful. He's lucky there. If you miss high throwing over the middle of the field, oftentimes that results in interceptions. So lucky that ball was incomplete. And here comes the offense on second down. Couldn't connect on first down. Now back to the air. And it's in. Golly, their defense has been the great at picking that up. Explosive play instead. They're looking at a third down. And how nice is it to have the home crowd going absolutely bananas? Communication is harder. The, the snapping the football, everybody being on time. Man, this crowd really affected the football. Big third down as the crowd gets behind this defense. Back to pass. It's Beck coming after it. And he got smacked just as he released the pass. It's incomplete. The Cyclones will punt this one away. They may have to pay him overtime. He's punting for the fifth time today. Here's the fair catch, and he'll make it. Oh, my gosh. You can't do anything offensively right now, dude. Iowa has it back on offense, hoping to ride the wave to the end zone. They hope to be able to cash in on this drive, David, after having to punt it last time. Yeah, and I think this offense needs to start it with the first play. You need to be oh my gosh, no. productive on that first play. Oh, I got so lucky. It's switch. Situations. No doubt, too. Don't you just switch feel like guys. a little bit more sense of urgency on this drive? It just feels like they've got to be able to put some points up on the board here. Grabbed in the middle. It's Lachey. And he laid the lumber to stop him from getting the first down. After the short completion, let's see if they go back to the air. Off the play fake. Unloads to the right. Let's go. Intercepted. Oh, Come on. What a big play in a tie game. Come on. He Come on, baby. Let's go. Huge play. play. And this junior makes a play. If I'm a QB coach, I'm grabbing what was my thinking? quarterback right away and be like, listen, we're going to get another Take that, though. It's the fourth quarter. It's a tie game. Our defense is going to get a stop for us. you got to get your confidence back. you got to get back in this ball game. The offense pops it up, and they were on the move. Once that ball was loose, the offense didn't have a Are chance. Are you kidding me? Everywhere. It's a turnover. What a clutch stop for us. Oh, my God. the fourth quarter, you got to make those Oh, where the heck is? Get the ball back to your offensive position now to go take the lead in this ball game. First down here with time for maybe one more play until the two-minute warning. They'll try the right side. Finds a little bit of space, gets three to the 22. It's just so nice to know you can start off on first down with positive plays. Positive yards, hand the football off, set up a good second down. Second down here, and maybe they've got time to get one more snap off before the two-minute warning. The clock has stopped as we have reached the two minute warning here in the ball game. Fumbled that. Get a pick, great field position, and we fumbled the first back, play. It's McNamara. Just a short pass to the tight end. And the defense had that one well covered, just a short game there. Everybody has to be set, they have to get it off. They'll try to get the first through the air. He got a hand in there, knocks it away, incomplete. You've got to be impressed by what you've seen from this defensive line in the game. Because Holy they're getting crap. To the quarterback, they're getting sacks, and when they can't get there, they're putting their arms up and they're batting balls down. It's so impressive watching this D line. Oh, I tried to fair catch that. Good job by oh, my gosh, that was scary. Iowa State sending the offense back out. After that last drive, he came back to the sideline and the coach probably said, you dropped it? You didn't pick it up? 
Come on, get on the ball, David. No, that's not what he said. He said, you're doing a great job. Just keep your head up. Yo, yeah, he got blasted. You got to hold on to the football, Palmer. Turnover. Why the backwards? It's tough on him, too, because he knows he let his offense down on that last drive. So you know that guy's eager and anxious to come out here and make a play. Offense gets set for second down. He's looking to throw. They've got the screen set up. What is and going he's a on? Nowhere man tackled in this no game land. Yeah, nice job by the defense. That's what you're supposed to do. As soon as they catch the football, you want to limit that yards after the catch. And he went nowhere after the catch. Nice job on the deep. These fans stepping up to help this defense on third down. From the gun, wants to pass. Oh, they really could have used that catch. Their physical pass defense, it brings up a fourth down. So on fourth down, here comes the field goal kicker in a huge spot. Is that enough? Tried to give it enough body English, but he missed it. And in the final quarter of regulation, we remain tied. This is well, the kicker was trying to put his team on the board and break this 0-0 tight. Just didn't have enough leg to get it done. Right. Iowa has the ball dude. back on offense. This one is about finding the balance between being aggressive and not being reckless, Jesse. The only way this thing works, though, if they're going to be aggressive, this offensive line has got to be able to hold up here for this QB. Yeah, because you need to take shots beyond the sticks. So the clock will stop, and you can save every second you have. This offense has a second down play. Back to throw, it's McNamara. And that's not the way they drew it up. It's incomplete. Well, I know it hasn't been a tremendous day statistically for this quarterback, but his decision-making has been good enough to win this game. Hasn't thrown a lot of TDs so far, but when things aren't open, he throws screen. it away like on that play right there. He's not putting his team in. And he can't get it off. Taken down. What a huge play this late in the game. Oh, my gosh, man, this defense. game. And the clock is stopped with 18 seconds left. Kicks it high, and it's just hanging there as if it has helium in it and floating down toward the earth. I get one good play. A first down for the offense. He's going to pass. He'll off one deep down the left side. Pass is incomplete, and we dwindle down to seven seconds. Man, you know the defensive coordinator on that play was holding his breath because in the fourth quarter, you got one of the fastest players in the game going deep on you, and that's going to be a helmet sticker for somebody. Like, forcing an incompletion against that guy? That's incredible. On second down, they'll take to the air. Fires to the tight end. And he might be known for one pitch, but that was a sure and heavy tackle on the tight end. Timeout is called with just two seconds. That's really what I wanted. Big third down as the crowd gets behind this defense. From the gun, wants to pass. Oh, he's going to try to hit him deep. It's in. Going OT. Clock strike zero, and we are headed to overtime. Well, guys, let's play some more. Headed to overtime. And this just feels right. Both of these Golly. teams going back and forth. So, of course, David, this thing needs to get decided in OT. Let's see who's better. Short amount of time to do it. A couple possessions probably. <laughs> Maybe one possession each. Who's the better team? All right, guys. Gosh, so here man, we go in game. overtime. And just to refresh everyone's memory, alternating possessions starting on the opponent's 25. And you want to play defense first because you want to know what you need. That's a Dang key it. philosophical approach for most teams when it comes to overtime, David. Yeah, and remember the rule change a couple years ago, too, in, in the second overtime and two-point conversion. So all this stuff is situational-type football that you better have worked on throughout these weeks of the season. On the 
And the Cyclones will have it first and ten. Going to run it. It's Jackson. And I can't I get give anywhere on the ground. And, coming up. and these defensive tackles just eat people. They swallow human beings when you get near them. They're so big, so strong. And those guys, those running backs coming, they just need a mitt. They put one mitt on a running back, and he usually falls to the ground just because of their sheer mass and strength. Well, this defense new coming in. I've been having a hard time field. finding anything see, okay. And a nice job there taking the throw away from the quarterback. From here, it would just be a 30-yard field goal try. Let's see how aggressive they're going to be to try to pick up that first down. It's complete to the left. Got some room. Mm. The goal line. Holy crap, he baby. Finally put the brakes on him at the three. A big throw, catch and run on that one. First and goal as they try to jump on top here in overtime. Turning to the running game on first and goal. You did not just... Diving for the goal line. Loose football. How Are you kidding me? From the defense to scoop it up. Bro, was a great relief for someone you're always thinking about as a defensive player. This is such bull crap. Start to come down and start to Seriously? And you know that ball's a little bit slick. Ah, runs are coming. You really try to get to that football. Nice job getting the football out. What the on top heck is the that? Defense has its back against the Pretty wall. Pretty much ball game. Extend this game and force another overtime. Got to get a turnover. The gift to the way. He's knocked down in the backfield. He'll lose a couple. And sometimes for the defense, it just takes one play, right, to create some momentum. Oh, like, Obviously, seriously, we're gonna fumble on the freaking much goal line. David, finally, David, to get something positive here in the run game defensively. But you kind of know that coming in. He's gonna get his. Such a great back, and he's had a great day. Need to put more plays together like that right there. I like the slot receiver because he gives his quarterback a good option working the middle of the field. He's a nice weapon in this offense. Off play action. And this is going to be incomplete on third. What? Yeah, and third and short, they choose not to run, throw the football, and I think a lot of that has to do with them. They know they're in field goal range. Annoyed because I fumbled on the one yard on the board. Timeout called by the defense as they want to make sure they avoid any hint of a mental lapse here in overtime. That's it. Lights out. Game winning. Oh my god, dude. That shouldn't have lost this season. This is one of the best games we've called this season. A thriller, and it comes down to the wild. Oh, I can watch these two teams play another six times this year. Just back and forth, trading blows, offenses coming up with explosive plays, big hits all over the field. David, this is what Yeah, a D tackle gets five sacks. No like, my interior line is I'm in Some good defense out there, too, there, homeboy. I know it's not just offenses that get you excited. Some defensive plays, too. Nip and tuck the whole game. I couldn't. Decided the biggest thing is just not being able to get any offense. That's I can get any offense going here. at all. Jesse Palmer, David I got Pollock, struggled Reece on Davis, offense. And this has been another presentation of EA Sports College Football. Yeah, 206 yards offensively. That's so bad. Average 1.1 carry a, a yard. 32 carries and 35 yards. When did I go for it on fourth? I don't remember going for it on fourth down. Uh, yeah, it's saying fourth down conversion, but I don't remember ever using a fourth down. Look at that red zone turnovers like three fumbles. Maybe it is counting that hurry up because I don't remember going forward and forth down. I hur I hurried up and I you know called that timeout punting, but. Before I leave this game, oh, I can right here. This is the highlight things we can go through. I can go through every, every quarter. 
Or is that all? I'll go through. We'll just go quarter one. Anytime we see fourth down, field goal. Field goal. Punt. 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 Field goal. Punt. Field goal. Field goal. Punt. 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 Miss field goal. Punt. There we go. Went through all of them, all the fourth downs, and there's nothing to not going for it. So I guess, I guess the um, hurry up, then the timeout for whatever reason is going down as a fourth down conversion. I was like, I don't remember going for it on fourth at all. Oh my gosh, three fumbles! Like those two at the end of the game. I'm talking to you, Siri. Run before the fourth and the OT. Like that's that's killer. so frustrating because when it's like not things that I can really control okay it's really frustrating Good thing is, is that uh, with this new game, you don't have to go undefeated. If I can go and try to win the Big 12 somehow, I still can make the playoffs. So um, there's that. But um, fortunate to lose this one. Battle all the way through. I could get things. This is not something you would think you'd hear often. I couldn't get offense going. I couldn't I couldn't really get it going at all um, this is this felt such like an Iowa Iowa State game it really felt like an Iowa Iowa State game like just offense can't struggle defensive game um, it sucks being on the losing end of them but it was a great game I was it was it was a fun one to do just wish I would have pulled out the win uh, all right, well, um, like I said, next week, what do we got? Do we have another computer game? I can't remember. Yeah, so Monday, we have our next spin. Uh, we got SMU on, on tap next week. There's no way that gets to click and preview the game in my team schedule, but this is what we got coming up next week. Um, SMU, we got our, our home game. So we'll have that sometime next week. Don't know which day yet, but we'll, we'll put the stream on. I'm off all week because it's it's uh, Thanksgiving break. So as being a teacher, I'll be off all week. So we'll see when this, this stream happens. Um, uh, hopefully we get our, our bounce back here against SMU and get ourselves back at over 500. I would like to always stay above. And we need to get things figured out. That might be a figure out offense kind of game before we get ready to play. West Virginia, that's going to be a tough one. Um, and then we go on a vicious five-game road streak at number six, Missouri, at number 20, Oklahoma, at user UCLA to a bye to go to at Arkansas, then at number 13, Oklahoma State. That's a very rough stretch here after we get the two. We'll get two straight home games and then five straight games on the road before we... Close out three straight home games. Uh, I hate losing rivalry games. But uh, thank y'all for tuning in. 
Until next time, this is Coach Silent. See if I can be raid somebody. Someone we're following. Anybody else playing college football? Good old stoner gamer. Let's go ahead and just throw it over to stoner. I appreciate you guys.